Welcome. You've got mail. I don't do many unboxing videos. I think I've maybe done two in my whole lifetime. But I thought this one might be fun. This is a box I got and it's not eggs. This box has done some traveling. It's gone from New York to me with the, the nasty Adam. Then it went back to New York with, the, with a fixed Adam. Now it's come back again to me with stuff for my gallery. So I thought that might be fun to open it up here. And, actually, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the box, I'm going to take the box, and we'll put it over here. Oh, and before I get too far, do you like my new friend? He talks, too. He does all kinds of stuff. Michael, let me show you. Let me show you what he does. Let me turn him on. I got to take him apart and fix him. I went thrifting, as they say, and I found him. And where's his on-off switch? Turn it on. He talks. Come on. Did I turn him on? Oh, there he's on now. I'm pushing a button in the back. I gotta take him apart to find out exactly why he doesn't keep moving. But he will keep going by himself after a while too. But I thought he was cute and I got him. And eventually I'll figure out what's wrong with him and fix him. I'm gonna call him Chimp. That's creative. Anyways, Chimp sits back here for now until he fixes him. But yeah, and he wears my extra fedora. So, I thought it would be fun to do this. I'm gonna open up this box of here. We're gonna see what we got in it. Well, I have a good idea what's in it because I have to pay for it, but I thought it might be nice to show you things that we're getting for the gallery. And hopefully, nothing's damaged. But we got this here. He said he would send this to me. My last video I did was on Cookie Monster Munch Time or something like that. That cute little video. And this is another one. Atari's Big Bird. Big Bird's Egg Catch. And it has a controller just like the other one. And it has the manual and the cartridge. And this one actually even has, you can see it in there. It has the overlay. So I thought that'd be cute. Now, and there goes something coming out of the floor. So, this should give you a hint what we got in here Mario and Duck Hunt for the gallery. And another Mario and Duck Hunt. Why so many Mario and Duck Hunts, you ask? Well, because we got a whole bunch of stuff for the gallery. And it's all Nintendo related. We have power supplies and power supplies. Is this a Nintendo power supply? It's an aftermarket, but okay. Power supplies. So we got three power supplies there. We got two copies of Duck Hunt and Mario. We have these, which are cute. I don't recall ever seeing them, but I don't know if the stickers were original to it. I'm pretty sure they would be. But you got that one. And that one see purdies then we have some more controllers one all right so I just had a phone call there so that's why we just jumped a little bit so let's see what else we got going here like I said more controllers basically this whole bag is number of controllers so we got three um, got some wires Three. Oh, oh, we got some rounded ones. These must be aftermarkets. Um, old school, classic, HD. We got a rounded one. Another rounded one. That's like that's like a. Oh, it's these classic or classic. And another controller. 
All right, so we got lots of controllers. So as I said, you probably got an idea where we're going with this. Well, let's continue on. Yep, another controller. This one fell out of the bag in there. We're gonna need some cleaning. Then we has a really exciting bag of wires, RF switches, RF switch boxes, and some AV connected cables. I need these. This is one thing I need for the gallery is AV cables. I am running out of them quick, fast, and in a hurry. Then, aha, boom, boom, booms. I got guns. We got guns. One gun. Boom, boom, boom. Two guns. So, Kind of interesting why they did different colors, but eh, all right, it's cute. I like it. Bang, bang, bang. Put some caps in it. That's cute. Yeah, that's our band. Now we go the next level down. So far, so good on the packaging. We has <gasps> an NES. Oh my God, an NES. We have an NES. Could you imagine that I got an NES with all this? Yeah. I did. And another NES. Try that. We got that going for us. And what else we got in here? Oh, hang on a second. Hang on. Another NES. Don't go nowhere. We got more things in the boxes in here. They're wrapped up in this plastic wrap, bubble wrap, street blankets. Another NES. We've got some yellowing on that one. We've got some NESs here. Oh yeah, NES. And we have, uh oh, uh oh. One more NES. So, oh, that one don't have a cover over it. That's fascinating. See, see, that one don't have a cover over it. But this one does. Cover over a cover. Why so? I don't know. I don't know what they do, but that's cool. Alrighty then, so what do we got here? We have five NESs. A couple of these will be set up in the gallery, but some of the stuff is gonna be going into the consignment shop too. So there we go, a whole bunch of guns. I have a 37 inch television, which, you know, I should take you guys I'm going to road trip to see that. I'm going to do that. I'm going to pause the camera. We're going to go on a road trip. All right, so let's go on a little road trip here. While I'm at it, I'll just give you an idea of what you don't see. There's the studio camera and all the lighting and stuff that they're going here. Go on a little road trip real fast. This may end up being the NES room. Got an NES there with that nice big TV in that one. Then we have a whole bunch of older systems in here set up. But this beast right here, that's a 37 inch TV that weighs about 150 pounds that I got to lift up and put onto a stand. That TV is going to be duck hunt. You're going to be able to play duck hunt on a 37 inch TV. That's going to be fun. So yeah, a little road trip. Get to see them. Just give you an idea what the gallery looks like a little bit. We're working on it here. And again, see, that's the studio there. And just so you want to wonder what I see when I'm talking to you. There it is. That's a kitchen. That's a restroom. That's my YouTube computer and an email system. But there you go. 